Connecticut is dealing with a shortage of plow truck drivers, and now the Department of Transportation is urging people to apply. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Zeller is joining us live from I-91 in Windsor with more on what this could mean for the upcoming snow season. Courtney. Well, the DOT tells us this could lead to longer response times in some areas, but they also say they are confident that won't happen. We will be dealing with this again. Snow season is quickly upon us and soon snow will be all over the roadways with plow drivers coming to the rescue. Our trucks are already loaded. Our blades are already on our trucks and so they are ready to go right now. But there's one problem. The Connecticut Department of Transportation is short more than 130 drivers this season. There's a 12% overall shortage based on past years. So they are encouraging people to apply. We are looking for all over Connecticut. And so based on the amount of people that we have or our number of employees that we have, we will spread out over Connecticut. We reached out to a handful of Connecticut cities and towns. For many, they are fully staffed, and that includes Windsor Locks and Vernon. If the state can't find enough drivers, you'll likely notice the impact. It could take longer for us to clear the roads, but regardless of the number of people that we have working, the DOT will get the job done. But they are confident they won't have that issue. Our crews take great pride in the work that they do, and I mean, just ensuring that we can clear the roads so that people can have safe passage from first responders to ensuring that people can get home to their families. Now, neighboring Massachusetts also dealing with the same issue, but uh, some towns just outside of Boston are actually offering incentives, some paying up to $310 per hour. If you're interested in being a plow driver here in Connecticut, we have that link right on our Channel 3 app. We're live from Windsor tonight. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.